the spooky colors channel so this is a different type of video that I thought would be um fun to film um when I did do like the massive 100 plus book um donating I just donated it so I thought I went through my books again that was maybe two three months ago and I want to do that every three months go through my books whatever I haven't touched and whatever's not my style anymore just has to go because it's just it's taking up book space um, you know whatever space on there that are not filled up with books I can put my supplies on so it just makes more sense to do that for me at least and then also a disclaimer any of the books any of the artists I show that's nothing to do with them it's just I just don't color it or I don't gravitate to it and it's just been sitting there so finding someone else who can give these a better home is just better for the books and better for me too um, so it's nothing to do with any artists or anything like that it's just either not my style or I just haven't touched it and it needs to go so this is the big color quest book um that's all I've done in it if I'm being honest so yeah like I'm really starting to get into pencils and coloring like non-color by number um I still do color by numbers like all my Disney are color by numbers um and then I have a few that are color by number that are not Disney so I do have a few but I'm more into the pencils and all that now so yes my my taste has changed that way but I'll never get rid of my Disney books because those have a like I just when I do feel like I don't want to pick my colors they're perfect to go to if that makes sense so yeah so anyways I'm getting rid of this one again and it will be donated to schools senior home etc all that this is Escape to Wonderland by Good Wives and Warriors these were like five bucks so I can pass it up but if you've been here long enough I'm not into the Zen Doodle stuff at all and I'm not into mandalas I know that for sure um yeah I'm just this is just not for me it's never been touched never been colored so someone will really enjoy it and it's a nice little small book sorry I'm just using this as a base next this is ceramic tiles dessert I don't know why I find these harder for me to color like I always go out of the line so that's kind of turned me off that's just me though sorry for the shadowing it's kind of bad lighting where I am right now um so it's just I haven't even touched this one so it's just it's not just not for me guys so someone will really enjoy that little simple book this is the valentine ceramic I haven't touched this either again I don't know just it's not for me they're very cute I just can't bring myself to color them so next this one's also brand new this is the 50 autumn mandalas I didn't get this too long ago Again, I'm not a mandala person. As much as this is not really mandala, it's just still not for me. So it's being donated. And I love Camellia Angelkova, so it's nothing against her. Next, I got two more of the ceramic tiles. Um, this is the Halloween one, and you guys are probably shocked. Like, oh, why aren't you keeping this one? Again, it's just, I don't know. It's just not for me, so it's going. And then I got the Easter ones. I didn't really touch this one. Oh no, I did. I did the carrot. So there's that. Next is Silhouettes by S I don't know who. I think Sun Life. I'm not sure. I don't know. Just yeah. Just not for me. That's all. Next I got stenciled art this is just these take way too long for what they are and I just yeah nobody got time for that at least for me I don't this one may be shocking to some of you but romantic country I'm just not into these at all um you know for prompts it's good to have an eerie book but I just I don't color them they're too much for me so yeah got rid of that Next is the creative 
coloring book, one color animal stencils. I think I've done a couple in here, but other than that, no, not for me. Next, this one's a huge one. This is a hundred animal mandalas. Again, not into mandalas. Haven't colored. Someone's gonna enjoy this a lot because there's a hundred in there. Next is Dollhouse by Sasha and Sasha and Deva. This is just very intense for a color by number. Um, yeah, it's just not for me. Not for me. And the lines are very teeny tiny, so I always colored out of it. And that, like, it's one of my pet peeves. Next is 100 Beautiful Mandalas. Again, <laughs> not a mandala person at all, so it's going. Hasn't been touched. I've had that for a long time. This one's Tiny Creatures by Coco Wyo. I don't know, just, I don't know, just can't color it. It's cute, it's very cute. That's all I've colored, and it came out atrocious, so it's not for me. Next is Princesses by Jade Summer. This isn't grayscale, so I'm like, nah. Not that I need a grayscale, it's just if it's a Jade Summer book, I'd rather it be grayscale, so yeah. So I will enjoy that. Um, next I got this Dolly Parton one. Again, it's very zen doodly, so it's not for me. I did that one, but that's about it. Donation. Next is Mystery Color. Christmas. Oh no, this is Mystery Color. Just Mystery Color, I don't know. It's just all animals or something, I don't know. So, I've done a few, but not a lot. Next, this is Villains Skylographics. Um, because I have a learning disability and it's dyslexia, I always, like, I messed up on that one. Like, I just mess up on these so bad. So it's like, this one's going in the garbage because I don't, <laughs> I feel bad giving someone, like, a messed up book. But, yeah, it's just, it's just, I can't with my brain. I can't. And then this one's even bigger. This is Spiroglyphics Animals. So, I did one in here, and it was this one, but even then, like, I always mess up on those, so I'm just, it's not worth it to me. Next, I got Color Tonic Animals. I have done a few in here, but I just, I don't know, just haven't touched it. So, if I haven't touched it, it has to go. Um, Mystery Color Christmas. I've done quite a few in here, but it's all like one after another, so yeah, I don't know, just, just, I needed to de-stash some books, that's for sure. This one is 50 Summertime Mandalas, this one's never been touched, so someone will enjoy that. Next I got 50 Springtime Mandalas. not really into the zen doodle stuff so 50 romantic hearts 50 romantic mandalas and heart designs not my style two more of the good wives and warriors this is escape to oz again too zen doodly for me i just yeah my brain goes like mush when I look at these so I can't color them and I love Shakespeare I got it like as you guys know I'm obsessed with Juliet and Romeo so I got for I've never saw this beauty till this night oh sorry for I have never saw this for I've never sorry I can't read oh my god sorry oh my god it's backwards so I'm trying to read through the camera and as you guys know my dyslexia flips everything so it's confusing it says, for I've never saw true beauty till this night. And then I got a little girl with um, like a little silhouette with a rose over her eye. So that's what I did. I love Shakespeare so much. But again, this is too zen doodly for me. And then these ones I've had for over a year and a half. So 50 lovely gnomes. Haven't touched it. Not a gnome person, so... 50 Christmas elves. Haven't touched it. So, yeah. I just... Yeah, so that's all. That's all the books I'm getting rid of. I'll just keep this here. It looks nicer. Um, 
it's nothing to do with the artists, nothing like that. It's just I can't bring myself to color them. And why keep something that I don't feel like coloring right? So when someone else can totally enjoy it so much better than I could. So yeah, that's that's why I'm doing that. That's why I'm decluttering. So I'm really happy about that. And I'll do like a little overview of my bookshelf. So all here are all my coloring books. I have to organize them because they are not organized. And all my Disney ones are not with the Disney. So it's driving me nuts. But see, like this was all books. And then even then I couldn't fit any and I keep all my Camellia Angel Cova miniatures and my Magic Mouse books together in a Walmart bag it's just way easier for me to grab I know that they're in there and it's easy so yeah but anyways these are most of my supplies all here and I have some up there and then I have a little coloring cart that just has some like random liquids and stuff for coloring so yeah but it's just it looks so much more nicer and tidier so it makes me happy so I'm really happy about that and I can give these books away to someone who deserves it um I was gonna do a 500 subby giveaway but the shipping in Canada here is crazy you guys like I mean absolutely absurd so I'm gonna wait till I hit a thousand and I'll do a big giveaway um a big giveaway um for sub for three subscribers so um, you know, I'll be paying three times the shipping, but that's fine with me. You each will get a Camille Angel Cova book. You will each get one Disney book of your choice. And, um, yeah, and then I'll ship them out to you. So that's what I'm planning to do. So stick around if you want to be a part of that giveaway whenever we do hit 1,000. Um, so, yeah, with that being said, please like, subscribe, and comment. Um, and leave a little jingle bell if you stay till the end. Um, I appreciate every single one of you and I hope you guys have a spooktastic day or night wherever you are from in this crazy world we call home and um, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. Okay, I love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye!